Hey guys, welcome back to the YouTube channel and back to the Supermoto bike build video series. This is episode two where we're going to be talking about slide protection for your Supermoto bike. Big thanks to Jeff at Toxic Moto. He supplied me with these awesome red Slide Moto Pro sliders. He is a one stop shop for all of your Supermoto needs. He has tires, he has wheels, he has brakes, he has sliders, suspension. I mean, everything that you can really look for for Supermoto. Jeff at Toxic Moto is your guy. Plus, he is our main AMA Supermoto supporter. He changes all of our tires. He sells all the tires. He brings extra parts. He is the go-to guy for Supermoto. So with these sliders, they are super easy to change from these, from these uh, guides. They take about no more than two minutes. And you guys will see right here. Thanks to Robert Orcozo for the awesome Honda tool rear axle nut, front axle nut on one tool. So we'll take this axle nut off. Once we get this nut off, we'll take the whole axle out. And basically what we're gonna do, I'm gonna try to do this without dropping the wheel. But just drop that down. We'll get this one right here where the end of the axle will go in. And it just fits right on in there, nice and easy. Put this back in. Get that axle slider in there. Pop the axle through. Boom. Easy as that. And then. As simple as putting this bad boy on there. Grab the axle nut and the washer. Put those on. And there we go. I don't have a chain on there right now. I have chains on the way, so I'll be putting that on once I get those. But it's as simple as that for right now. And that's, like I told you guys, no more than two minutes. Now the front ones are also just as easy. So we'll go ahead and go to the front. So coming over here to the front, we just use our actual tool to get this actual nut off. And then we replace it with our slider that has the threads right there. And that is your new actual nut. So you just get yourself one of these extensions right here. Just goes right in there. And that is how you tighten your new axle nut. You're going to want to grab the side that has this little rubber piece right here. And basically that's just going to go inside your axle. And when that goes in there, you'll be able to use one of your Allens here. Use that to tighten that up. And voila, it expands right inside your axle and it's part of your axle now. And that's how easy it is to put these Slide Moto Pro sliders on, on your bike. That's exactly why I prefer these, just for the simplicity of them and how quick it is to put them on. Some other sliders we're gonna be putting on is a pipe slider. You just slide that, slide that right on the pipe, super easy to put on. That protects your pipe, keeps that thing nice and pretty. Like I said before, just slides right on like that. And then we'll just have to tighten up this clamp right here. The reason I really wanna put this on is because this Yoshimura pipe is awfully too clean. I mean, any, any pipe you're gonna put on is gonna be really clean and you're gonna wanna keep it nice and protected, but definitely keeps it looking nice and pretty. Nice and make sure it's nice and snug where it's not gonna go anywhere. 
and voila you got your pipe slider on she's looking pretty good so far with that pipe slider and the axle sliders on there we also have some hand guards which just go right just like that and they have this nice little rubber end piece for sliders so that way you don't mess up your hand guard your your bars or anything like that so that way pretty much all touching points of the bike on the ground when you do slide out are rubber sliders and everything is those are super cheap super replaceable and you don't have to get yourself into set of new graphics or a new pipe or anything like that first thing we're going to want to do is trim this grip on both sides that way we can get that bolt through there that'll hold the hand guards on So make sure to head over to Talks About Moto Racing, your one-stop supermoto shop. If you guys liked today's video, please make sure to subscribe and turn that notification bell on that we don't miss any future episodes. And if you can, like and comment on this video and share it with a friend to give them the information they need to get their own supermoto bike build going. Make sure to tune in for episode three as we're gonna be talking about as you're getting faster on this bike, you're gonna definitely need this next upgrade. So make sure to tune in. I'll see you guys in the next video.